I'm Matt Savage, and you're watching The Savage Beat. This week's Savage Beat comes from the World Poker Tour $5 million guaranteed mini main event on Party Poker, where first place was over $750,000. We start today's show on the final table bubble where the most classic flip takes place when Daniel Montagnoli takes his ace king up against Livia Bartha's queens. The queens held, and as we'll later find out, it propelled Livia Bartha to a massive payday. Now I'll take you to a couple hands featuring pocket jacks, a hand that I love to hate and never know how to play correctly, but these players show us how it's done. In the first example, Roberto Romanello plays the jacks the correct way, extracting maximum value from his opponent, Giannis Lowe's, who catches an unlucky top pair 10 on the river to seal his fate in the hand. In the second hand, sometimes you can make a great laydown with jacks as Ren and Bruschi does here in a tough spot versus Nikita Verbici with Queens. In the Baby Aces Battle of the Week, we have Ace-6 top two pair for Liviu Bartha, and Ace-3 top pair in a straight draw, which connects on the river to save Ren and Bruschi to which Sam Trickett says, that's an unfortunate river. In the Big Blind Special Hand of the Week, even commentator James Dempsey doesn't know what Liviu should do with Jack-3 and only five bigs, but he did get it in and a red-hot Ren and Bruschi has tens, makes the easy call to bust Bartha in four. I'm starting to sound like a broken record here on the Savage Beat, but the final hand of the tournament is both the cooler and the clincher of the week, as Nikita Verbici turns a straight and Renan has top set. The board pairs on the river, and Bruski checks again, and Nikita bets. Renan shoves, and Verbici calls, thinking he has a key double up, not to be, as Bruski has a full house and the title. Congratulations to Renan Bruski, the champion of the WPT Party Poker mini main event.